Hello Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to take a look at your situation with you and your person in mind. Remember that this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate for everyone. You can always take a look at your other placements. You may find some messages there for you. And if you're interested in a personal reading much like this, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you guys, okay? All right, so I'm seeing that in your recent past here, we have love, unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction here between you and your person. I see that for some of you, you haven't been showing this person how you really feel though. You've been hiding your true feelings here. You've been um, pretending that you don't really, uh, you, maybe you're pretending you're like playing hard to get type of situation here. But I get that there was a, somebody has expressed their love Somebody has made an offer. There, I see that something has started between you guys. A start of um, planting the seeds towards a commitment here. So I'm seeing that there was a solid offer towards a, a new beginning, a new start. And I see that this is something that, very, that surprised you. So um, like this is just telling me like a love bomb. Like someone just laid it all out there. A huge uh, a huge shock with that tower card so somebody wasn't expecting um, that the other person you or your person wasn't expecting that somebody felt so strongly with that love card and I see that there was a major lesson that you have learned in love in your past here that has closed so with that world card, it, this is behind you. In your person's energy, we have heart with the key. Welcoming love, meeting the one, open your heart, getting together and perfect. So, wow, guys. Your person really thinks of you very highly. This person, wow, this person is in deep, deep, deep regrets okay with this five of cups they are they feel your loss here okay they feel your loss I see that um like shit just hit the fan in the past here there was a uh, major chaos and they're having an awakening right now with that five of cups they're really realizing that they messed up big time. They are deeply regretting it. They're in their head about you because now they're starting to realize like you are the one that got away here. They feel like you're the one. And yeah, so Four of Cups, this person, they feel rejected by you they feel um like you are ignoring them you're not accepting their love offer you don't want what they have to give here and they feel like things are at a standstill right now things are not moving they're at a crossroads here you're not speaking so you may have blocked this person but I see that you're not speaking right now. You have your backs turned towards each other. But this person still, um, they still love you. And um, they still feel like you're the one. But they feel as though you're rejecting them. Or you don't want their offer or their apology here. But they're, in, they're regretting this very, very deeply. You consume their mind. You consume their thoughts and they feel the loss here. So let's take a look at your energy here with this mask. Judgment. Ooh. Wow. Okay, guys. So major, you're 
you're receiving a major awakening here. You're looking at things clearly now when it comes to your person. And I see that there's, you're realizing what needs to change here. And I see that you're, you're acting very cold or detached emotionally to this person. You're not really speaking, but I see that for some of you, you want to have another chance here with that judgment card. You want to revive the situation, but you're not showing, you're not showing that. You're not showing your true feelings here about what you're really wanting. Um, and, but I see that you want to see if there's another chance here. If there's another chance to have renewal in this because now you're awakening to what should have changed or what changes need to happen here because I see that something needs to change and you are receiving that clarity. You're having a major awakening here. Literally, like, you're, you're very clear in your thoughts. You're very clear on what you um on your truth as well so you're being called you're being called to take action and i see that there's some something that you're wanting to communicate here towards your person i do see that you are wanting to have a reconciliation because you do feel a very strong bond here and you do want to try to give this another sh another chance, but you're not showing your feelings. Um, you, I, I'm getting it's on both sides. You both love each other, but you were like our backs are turned towards each other here. So I see that in the near future for you guys, we're still. We're still giving each other like the cold shoulder, I, but I see you most, mostly just focusing on yourself, your self-indulging in yourself, your self-worth, taking the time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation. But I see that something isn't really changing. Something isn't really changing here. I, I get that um, there is... There is communication that's coming in here. There is um, something exciting that has to be said. It's an offer and also an apology. Something Somebody wants to apologize for not saying the entire truth because I see that you've re you've you uh, the truth has come out in a situation and I see that there is like an apology here. Um, somebody wants to apologize for um, not saying the entire truth here, not speaking their full truth, and somebody wants to take action here. So I do see that there's a message coming in for you guys, but it, it looks like this person has really turned you off. Let's see, we have in your outcome, we have the sunglasses. Watching, looking, stalking, perception, and focusing out here. Okay, so you know what? <laughs> this is so funny. You guys aren't fooling me, by the way. Like, strength card, the sun card. You two are going to be together again. So it, it just looks like... We're ignoring each other, we're not speaking each other, but we're also taking time to heal. But you guys are coming back together. Um, you two are both watching, looking at each other. And by the way, if you're at this reading, you're also keeping tabs. This is a way of keeping tabs. But I do see that it's going to make you really happy. So this is good news. Strength in the Sun card. This is just amplifying this happiness, amplifying... Um, the sun card is the the happiest card in the deck, all right? But with the strength card, this is even more powerful. It's giving it more power. So this is huge for you guys. It's going to make you really happy because I see that you two really love each other. 
okay you two really love each other and I see that there's a really strong bond between you guys and things are becoming more clear so I'm seeing that there's a new perspective here somebody's looking at things from a new perspective in terms of the situation this lesson has come to an end and I see that um, I'm seeing that there's something really bright there's like just look at the colors look how bright this is there's a really bright outcome um, for you guys but I'm seeing this that I'm seeing that this is a reconciliation after having this fallout after having um, shit just hitting the fan sabotaging a situation and um, I see that you guys are kind of revisiting things and I see that there's a wish fulfillment here with that nine of cups so being very satisfied being very happy so wish fulfillment you're you're getting what you wanted and it's some changes here with that judgment so especially with the five of cups fives to me represent changes so changes I, I see on both sides I see on your side I see on your person's side as well and look at that another five two fives so let's get some details for you guys I'm seeing Leo I'm seeing Pisces Cancer and Scorpio energy here okay some details here for Virgo yes yeah, so things something could have ended in the winter time in the colder months when it's snowing I see that right now you don't really know where you two stand with each other here. Um, something, it, it's your person, they are, they are really confused on how you feel about them. They don't really know like what's true and what's not coming from your side. And, but I see that. I'm seeing that somebody is letting go of control here in the outcome, letting go of trying to control the situation and just going with the flow. So I see that there is a, a communication coming in here with a twin flame, trying to balance things out, make things right. But I see you're focusing on yourself, healing yourself as well. So let's get a few more cards for you guys before I close off this reading. Oh, we got love yourself first, your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So I see that there's a big lesson on self-love here. And um, I see that we have very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. So it looks like to me your person has made a decision that they want to be with you, that they you're the one. Soulmate, yes, this is your, yes, this is your soulmate or twin flame. There is romantic feelings here. Your feelings are real and worth exploring and express your love. Go ahead and make that romantic gesture. Strength card. I see that you two are going to be together again. So this is what I'm getting for you, Virgo. If you like this reading, please comment, like, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated and I hope that you found some guidance or clarity in your situation and thank you for watching. Bye.